The search continues tonight for a man police believe is responsible for killing a beloved Memphis dance administrator. Juanita Washington was shot last month outside Walgreens on South Perkins. WRG's Jordan James explains how investigators were able to pinpoint a suspect. Two weeks after the death of Juanita Washington and Memphis police believe they know who's responsible. MPD says surveillance footage from Walgreens appears to show Gregory Morden pulling up to Washington's car and fire several shots. The shooter then drove off in this white van with AG lawn care on the side. The department says the van was later recovered. The address for AG lawn care is the same address listed for Morden. We stopped by Thursday evening and no one answered. What's unclear at this time is the motive for the shooting. Washington family previously spoke with us about this unexpected loss. It's a void. It's a big void missing. And I mean, missing is like a literally a piece of me is gone. It's gone. It's a hole there now. I'm mending, but the believe me, it's hollow. This week, Memphis police issued two warrants for Morden. Court documents reveal that Morden is a convicted felon and has faced multiple charges over the years, ranging from assault to attempted first degree murder. Now, he awaits additional charges once he's located. Reporting in Hickory Hill, Jordan James, WREG, News Channel 3. Thank you, Jordan. And if you have any information about Morton's whereabouts, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at 901-528-CASH.